It is, of course, dangerous for everyone during the pandemic, but UCSF researchers say they now know which workers are most at risk. NBC Bay Area Sergio Quintana spoke with a woman behind the project and has the details. It's a sobering truth. Overall, the chance of dying in California for working adults has certainly increased in the pandemic. Working age adults in California had about a 22% increased risk of dying from March on compared to prior years, and that's because we're living during a pandemic. Her researchers reviewed death certificates across the state to compile their data. They found among the deadliest jobs because of the pandemic is restaurant and agricultural work. In fact, if you're in those industries, your chance of death doubles to about 40%. What's worse, researchers found Latinos in those industries saw their chance of death go up to about 60%. The communities that um, have the least means, the most need to work, and the least power within their workplace to make sure they can keep themselves safe, uh, that, that are really facing the highest burden People who work in those industries or who have loved ones who do are not surprised by the findings. My husband is a chef um, at a, a restaurant and I worry about him. You know, I see actually a lot of people doesn't say they, they have a positive uh, corona, you know what I mean? They, they like, oh, I don't want to tell anyone, you know what I mean? This is really scary actually. We have to tell, it's not shame, you know, it's a, it's a virus. Restaurant owner Zaid Al Masri says he's had to reassure employees because some are still scared of losing their jobs if they get sick. While restaurants and agricultural workers have been hit hard, warehouse and delivery workers are also dying at higher rates, followed by grocery and retail employees. Dr. Bibbins Domingo says this new data should be considered as we continue to roll out vaccines across the state. But if we really want to prevent deaths in California, we also have to focus on those who are younger than 65, who are doing riskier types of work. The findings come as the state considers whether to change the vaccination rollout to focus on age groups instead of industry. In San Francisco, Sergio Quintana, NBC Bay Area News.